Hi there, and this is a toolbox, a wooden toolbox, which is quite old. I reckon it's about 60 years old, at least, something like that. I'm going to have a go at refurbishing it. The first thing I'm going to do is, if you can see, is have a go at this key, because it's rather bent. So I'm going to have to make a new key. It does still work. Uh, there we are. Let me fold that down. Got a green baize. Uh, material there which is a bit worn the wood actually though doesn't look too bad the lot obviously still works so I'll put that to one side inside we've got all these drawers this, now it's full of or it was full of old tools there in a bag this, this is a base that you can attach various uh, engineering tools to So this is the, the front of it. If you can see, there's that um, sticker or paintwork there. I can't quite... More and Right, actually, it says. More and Right, Sheffield, England. So that... Let's see what this does. Just grabbing all of it with this chisel and scraping it back, and then it tends to lift up like that. There it is pulled off. I think it takes scraping me. I'm going to use Danish oil to put the finish on the drawers. There we are, that Danish oil really brings out the uh, grain on the front of that. Very nice. Makes that look lovely, that does. Let's do the sides.
and they measure what's that 151 by 146 and I've got this um, sticky backed gold coloured um, base that I'm going to put in there Well, the toolbox is now completed and we can see here, if I spin that around, you can see that finish on the outside. There's the back and the sides. The finish is Danish oil and then a coat of furniture wax. If I open the front, There we can see the coloured bays that I've put on the inside. Nice gold colour, it was dirty green. And here we've got the um, more and right logo there. And every drawer has got the gold finish inside. Um, the handle, the original leather handle is still on there which I've cleaned up with some shoe polish. All the metal work has been cleaned using a Dremel and particularly the lock there is now nice and shiny. Oh and of course the key which was in a poor state is now cleaned, cleaned with the Dremel and now it's relatively relatively bright and shiny so there we are there's the toolbox complete finished and i rather like it thank you